Guys, today's my birthday, and that means we are going to host a Trackmania Cup. $1,000 prize pool. I'm gonna build a map. We're gonna have a qualifier. Anyone can play, and we'll see who uh, gets to be the best player in Cup of the Virtual. Let's hop in and let's try to build something cool. It's always fun when you open a new canvas like this because you can literally build anything. So, uh, yeah, right now I'm just placing blocks trying to find something that could be cool. You know what I really miss, chat? Every campaign used to have like a sausage tech map. Not that this is going to be one, but weren't they a bit cool? I really thought they were fun. Uh, maybe the other way? No, too sharp. Oh, I think this could be cool. I like this. Because now, look what's going to happen. We do this. We do this, but then, but then, but then. We also do this. Oh, undo. I think this works. I kind of like that. Uh, I feel like I've done sausage blocks. We need some stunts, we need some obstacles, we need some action. Let's do this. I'm thinking of using bobsleigh blocks. But I don't really like bobsleigh that much anymore after the physics. I'm still getting used to it. Yeah, so you're coming from a left turn, so you want this to be a right turn, probably. Here's what I'll do, chat. <laughs> This is a this is a bobsleigh turn combination that I built for like a mapping project with many other mappers and they rejected it. They said no you can't build this. I said why and they said it's too hard. Maybe a bad idea to uh to do it now, but it's my birthday. So I can do what I want. <laughs> it's this one. Yep. Yep, that's the one. <laughs> Don't hate this chat. It's gonna be fine. Even if you're not gonna bobsleigh, you can drive this. I believe in you. I believe in you. You can drive this. Have faith. Like, it's super drivable. What happened here? There we go. Cool. I just want to make a bobsleigh turn combination I've never seen before. Maybe if I do this, I want this to be sharper. Because now given a lot of space, so now this can be super sharp. Smile. Yeah, I think that's fine. I really don't know if it's that bad. Watch, 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 watch. I'll save it, I'll save it, I'll save it. Okay, let's fr from the start, right? From the start. Hold, hold your judgment. The map will function like this. You drive. You go into the bobsleigh. Hup, hup, hup. Hup, hup, hup. Okay, you get a higher line. You get a higher line. The landing is a little unsmooth. The angle you land at is kind of wrong. It's gone. Wait, wait, I have I have two ideas. I have two ideas. This is the first one. Wait. Uh, let's go to idea number two. You need to dare to take some risks sometimes when making a map. This is the risk I dare to take this time. You need to be brave. Intux added, I'm done. Intux doesn't like this because it was a collab map with him. And this idea, everyone on the that wasn't that collab was like, no, don't do it. No, don't do it, Virtual. It's too sharp bobsleigh turns. At this game. It goes too sharp, though. This guy, Sigma, is... What am I supposed dude. to do with this? Happy B day, Viet. Like, people are not gonna make this jump chat. Like, oh, jump across. Oh, jump across. People are not gonna make this. In a knockout format? To this. It needs to stop adding these structures okay so far we have a very drivable track <laughs> very drivable chat <laughs> just like i wanted oh it kind of goes out this side okay interesting yeah this is going to be quite difficult but i think also exciting i think you know you have to strike the balance between like making a map most people can drive but also a map that 
has some excitement for spectators, and that's us. We're gonna be watching the best compete on this, you know? We want... We want a little bit of spice. I'd love if this is a... Oh, one of these. Uh, where you, where you, like, approach this corner in a way that you are rewarded for avoiding penalty grass and you have a sharp approach. <laughs> I know what this is gonna turn into, so I'll... No, 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 hey, no. Hey, what you will um, love your content, my man. Let's do this inside. Thank you, I appreciate it. What do you have in mind? I want another uh, stunt or trick or something here to keep the suspense, to keep the audience on the edge of their seat. What could we build here that would do that? Hmm, I think. Transitions, chat. We're building transitions. Transitional map. Terrible. <laughs> I forget how much space you need for stuff like this. This better work, chat. I'm I'm on my last uh, last brain cell. What a map. Ooh, no, that's kind of cool. And then like a super sharp downhill, right? I like that. The only thing it needs is trees. No good map is made without scenery. <laughs> Guys, who makes maps without scenery these days? Beautiful. Beautiful. I don't know how I'm expecting everyone to be able to drive this, but... I think I'm starting to realize I might not be catering to everyone. But to the viewers, this is gonna be very exciting! Ah! <laughs> this is terrible. This is terrible. Okay, the track is gonna continue... Here, down here. It has to be grass, I think. Are you regretting your choices, chat? Leaving me in the kitchen all by myself. We'll find out now if this was a good idea. This is when we find out. I mean, okay, so that works. That was not what I wanted, though. Um, checkpoint out here somewhere. Now is the time. Now is the time. The time to be brave. We don't want the map to end on a low note. Oh no, no. We want to end it on a high note. No hesitation, let's just make a massive bug slide. Whew. Okay. The one thing this needs is walls. It definitely needs walls. Okay, I want a very steep hill here. Actually, several. <gasps> oh my god, is this gonna be terrible? <laughs> Twitch Prime? I have Twitch Prime once. Like, some people say you should only add a little bit of chili. This is like... My cuisine right now is just adding a lot of spice. This is something I've never seen before. Is it? Is there a reason? If you make something that Happy no birthday. one's ever seen before, it's either genius or not very genius at all. In this case, it is genius. Clearly. <gasps> Use your prime brothers. <laughs> Holy shit. Now, you know what I want? I want there to be a backup jump over here. Okay. <laughs> Wild. I think this is it. Let me check. Let me check. Let me check. Let 
this guy's Sigma is... Dude. Terrible, terrible safe way. Perfect. <laughs> I think this is good. Cup of the birthday. So, the cup starts in five minutes. Anyone can play chat. Top 100 play in Division 1. It's the prize pool division. So people have 15 minutes to qualify. Now what I would really recommend here. Drive one run, no matter what, to the finish line. Don't try to be like fancy and get like a clean run immediately. Just your first run, drive it to the finish line no matter what. Even if it's 45 respawns. It doesn't matter. You need to get a run on the board. You, you need to get a run on the board before the time runs. And this is a hard map. Like, this is gonna be difficult. To get up that thing might be very difficult for a lot of you. Oh no, I see the shadows here did not compute very well. Okay. So that section is also gonna be a bit difficult. Uh, and then... <laughs> honestly, this... Feel free to try it, but it's super hard to get to the platform up here. And yeah. And then just, you know... I don't want to take any spots, but... Techie's so far ahead in Khaki that he's taking time off... ...from his... ...potentially historic back-to-back -back win... ...to play my cup... ...and farm me for money. Or maybe I've just built another Khaki map. Maybe this will be his 65th completion. Winning this event. Look at the run. I cannot watch the run until... Uh, or can I? But maybe I can. That'll be hype. Yeah, this is the leading run right now, chat. That's kind of sick. This took him two minutes to figure out, or three minutes. So he got a decent bobsleigh. <gasps> Walligan got a 46. Oh, he kind of failed here. So not that clean yet. <laughs> but I think he got the bug slide. Oh. <gasps> Elect to not drive the full penalty grass. Okay. And... Wah. Beautiful bug slide. Yes! Okay. We're spectating the leader right now. Scroll. He beat Jan. Went up. Look at that. Oh, he had an even better low jump. Releases the turn. Look at all that time gain. Way more speed through here than the others. Now the bug slide. Super inside line too. This might win the quali. How are people going to beat this? This was so clean. Wow, that might win the qualifier. So let me repeat the stakes here. We're on Division 1. The top 100 players in the qualifier have made it. Top 3 get prizes. $1,000 total. $600 for first. $300 for second. $100 for third. May the best player win. Can you watch the player north? It's really important. Buckley, did you make him drive? With your car skin. The, in, who would, in the right mind, out of the thousand skins you can pick in this game, thousands, would pick this one? First round's underway, and there will be one, two, three, four, five, six... Six knockouts per round, I believe? Until we hit 64 players, so yeah. Let's see the bobsleigh. Uh-oh, some players that are way too high already. Some players that are way too high up here and they're not going to make this jump. Oh, one guy was upside down. There's been a lot of mistakes, a lot of blunders. Now the palms. Uh-oh. <laughs> We're losing a couple of cars here too. One guy going way too wide up there. That's unfortunate. But the bug slide is what I care about. Are they going to get the bug slide? Fred Wolf. That's a beautiful bug slide. Does he get past the trees? 
Oh! Eidos! And he will be the winner of the first round, but look at this. There is Carnage, Onion Boy. Racer and they are Dr. TJM. All stuck in the box like they are gonna go for it. Despite being far. Lars, who was really quick in the first no KO. Also struggling here. Uh-oh. A lot of players have not finished. Five seconds left. The timer. I think Lars gets there. I don't know if Davin gets there. Dinzu gets there. 15 players out. Oh my god. That is so unexpected. Very unexpected here. Uh-oh, Dinzu backwards. Oh no, I see other couple of players struggling to make it up to this platform. Looks like they're here now though. Dinoso was the player in Zaki. Also scroll down here. Who uh who was thanking me earlier for a great map. Oh whoa on his car. He needs your support right now, chat. Scroll. Can he make the comeback happen? Into the bug slide. Whoop! That looks good. Is it far enough? Oh, beautiful landing. And with this, he's gonna save himself 30 spots there in that bug slide. Fava too much sideways. Saki, who was last, is still out. Uh, still in, still in, still in. Fava just barely making the bug slide now, but it might be too late. It might be too late. It is too late. Seven players still out. And a world record? World record by Heave. 44-45. Good spot, good spot. We're down to good. 71 players. Happy birthday, you legend. Sorry about this. Nadeo decided it was a good idea to give people access to put any sound file they wanted into the game. Happy birthday. Any audio file a player wanted to play at any given time could be just put in game. Really just testing the creative limits of degenerate gamers. Sorry about that. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Lil Borgir. Not too happy about this. Ooh. Okay, he finally makes it. What's the damage? He is about 10 seconds behind. Smithy as well, making a mistake, having to respawn. Luca, despite being in spot number 69, makes it very nice. And he's back. Smithy on the bug side now. Also gonna make it. Very nice. Wait, 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 wait. Uh, whoa, uh. He's in. I believe he's just barely in. He claimed the last spot with that. There is no way he was like this close to out. I don't think he's going to catch his breath before the next round. I really don't. Lars with the world record. This guy's Sigma is... Dude. Pretty dank. You. Vilkas, thank you. Kura Cobra, thank you. Eisenwolf, thank you as well. Let's follow the action. Smithy has recovered from that mistake previously. Almost up in first now. Hang on. Uh oh. Uh oh. Not the worst mistake. Not the worst mistake. Some people still struggling in the bobsleigh here. Including Heave. Who was one of the people driving super fast earlier on. Let's see. It's bug slide in time. It's bug slide in time. Whoop. Is that a good angle? It looks like it. He's gonna make it. <laughs> Feel man through the trees. Easy. Still 20 players left who can claim a spot here. Jan van Achter going for it now. Seven seconds left to the timer. Takes down to zero. He's not gonna make it. Clear vision perhaps. Gets there. He's still out. Clear isn't still out. The last person in here was Scroll. Oh my god. He's living on the edge. How did I do? I um I I I did not play. I'm spectating. I built the map. But I think even if I did, um I would not be beating these guys. 
These guys are driving fast. <gasps> uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, this is a painful save to make, but it's one you have to make. Does he have the speed to get up this wall? No, I don't think so. Ah, okay. He does. He does, actually. And now it's only four knockouts, guys. It's only four knockouts per round. Avon is almost out. Previously, a Trek Mania Grand League player. Really good player as well. It's gonna catch up to Shiny, but he needs one more spot. Not going for the bug slide, despite being this far down. That's a risky move. Shiny goes for the bug slide. Does it? No, he does not make it. T-Tamer, maybe. He makes it. And where is Avon? Avon only on the boosters now. Tamer in. Scroll might be... Ah! Oh, he's in. Okay. He's living so much on the edge, I do not understand. Scroll, you gotta catch your breath. You got time, relax, you got this. Breathe. What's my author time? It was like 47. And people are driving 44s here. People are driving very fast. Oh, I like this move. I really like this move by this player. He just recognized, you know what, I can release and I can avoid all my problems in the bobsleigh. Great uh, awareness to do that. Took it slow, took it comfortably safe. People are going for the bug slide now. Whoa, Sile with the first place. Ixon has failed it. Um, some other players going for the safe route. 43-9 by Wosile. Did Wosile just anti himself? This guy's Sigma is... Dude. No, he wrote thank you. Birthday. I think he wrote... <laughs> that is kind of a chad move though. If you finish first, you, you have time to write nice time to yourself first. So why not do it? Let's watch this man. See how he does. One of the only Swedes that I'm rooting for. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I think I just cursed my own nation by saying this. Uh-oh. Wicked, but is it enough? Uh-oh. Oh, 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 it's so far. It is so far. Okay, they need big mistakes, but people have made mistakes, though. People have made mistakes. Oh, <gasps> What? He respawned again? Dommage. From 43.9 to 43rd. Anything can happen. Anything can happen. Truly. Top 27 now. It's getting close. Top 3 get prizes. It is a $1,000 prize pool. Split amongst the top 3. 600 for first. 300 for second. 100 for third. We've seen quite a lot so far. Especially the players Leo and Scroll and Sinks have been facing eliminations time and time again but save themselves. They are the ones to look uh, look for right now. Happy birthday, Wetuel. I hope you've had a good Thank day. Thank you so much, Wireman. I don't normally do this, but here's some birthday bits to have some beers on me. Did Nick and Anna get you anything nice for your <laughs> birthday? Neither of them got me anything. Actually, but that's okay. I'll remember that. I'll just remember that And get them something nice on their birthdays um, Because um, because I'm just that type of friend, you know 
<laughs> but I appreciate it. Thank you so much for the final bits. Sinks out. The journey only went so far, but well played. All right, Buckley, this one's for you. I hate giving screen time to uh, to this menace of a car skin, but let's watch this player. Surely he wouldn't fail. <laughs> uh oh, Link is in danger. That's gonna put him too high. Oh. And Senor Kaki as well, in a little bit of danger. We have the top three here going for the bug slide. Lars going on an inside trajectory. We had Radiance missing the bug slide. Lars getting too low speed as well. Scroll making it. Zooming into the finish. Fast time here too. 45 flat. Link fell to start now. Facing elimination. We also saw Cheese Lover. Oh, Leo not having the speed. Sano not having the speed. Link might just clutch this and overtake one. He will. Icer flying so far. Missing the finish, I believe. Oh, no. Oh, no. And he got sniped. Oh, no. Oh, no. No way, XDD. Oh, no. Top 19, the last four knockout round. After this, it'll be two knockouts per round. <gasps> Heave might not make it up the thing he does, but he's last. F6 last as well. F6 upside down. Together with Link and Matt Hyper. This is the battle to take a look at. How is the buggy slide gonna treat him? Wiko's having the speed, making it up there. Cheese Lover as well. They are safe. What about F6? What about Matt? They're not going for it. F6 going for it. Oh, this could be clutch. He needs to catch two spots. Avon is one of them. I believe he is in time though. Two more spots. And it's locked in. It is locked in. Heave Snow, Inferno, and Link out. Big French knockout. Me and you need to have a talk when it comes to mapping. But this is so exciting though, no? A little bit of French mapping. A f like French cuisine on my birthday. Two knockouts per round now. This makes it all the more important to use the bug slide because you could really catch up a lot of spots in the ending there. So, uh, a little bit of a fail in the start here by two players at least. Maybe three. Looking at this right now, I think, uh... So, oh! Uh-oh. Blast. Hitting that tree, double respawn. Now the bug slides. What are people feeling here? Aerosol making a calm, collected decision to not go for it. Is that gonna pay off? Was one spot away from elimination here. Blast as well, not going for it. That is a daring move. But he gets the last spot in. That is really daring. You are down 10 seconds before the last check when you don't go for it. Simple choice. Top 13. Let's see who gets through this now. We have quite a lot of characters in this. Oh, Lars going very high here to try to get this landing to get up. And he will get up, but he might be last. I think every everyone got the start. That's the cleanest round so far. So Lars has been playing for the most part very consistently, now in danger. Calm collected decision making once again. Scroll going for it and making it. 
Did anyone not make it? Cheese Lover made it. Tacky made it as well. And now the safe finishes are coming through. F6 though in a little bit of trouble between the trees makes it. Lars and Aerosol are the last two players in. Radiance and Matt hyper out. And, Lo and Aerosol once again. Calm collected gameplay. Here we go. Top 11. Scroll has had some close calls. Tacky as well. Aerosol now lately. Quick won the qualifier. Walligan drove world record earlier. Avon had some close calls. Cheese Lover had some close calls getting banned for this car skin. But he's still in. Okay, Aerosol, this is... If you survive this, Aerosol, you literally have to stop trolling. He can hear me right now. If you somehow make it through this round, it is time to stop trolling. Ixon failed the bug slide. Are any of the players up top gonna fail? No, that looks all good for the three. What about players on the save finish? Oh, <gasps> he went for the bug slide now. Oh no. He is committed. Committed, but this was a fast round. 51 seconds to be in. Happy and Aerosol birthday, is out. My guy. Thank you. One more two knockout round for one knockout. We're gonna commence. They've played so many rounds so far. 21 rounds. A regular couple today is 23 rounds. So you can really feel the exhaustion at this point. It would basically be like being in a cup of the day final. On a very intensive map. Just about everyone gets to start now. Have one just a little behind. Let's have a look at the overview camera. So we go into the bug slide. Quick and Lars going for it up front. F6 as well. Cheese Lover and Lars have respawned. F6 and Lars and Avon and Cheese Lover. There's four respawns and two safe spots. They're all going for the bug slide now. I think F6 is going to make it. Lars is not making it. Oh, they're all on the side. This is so close. Cheese Lover not getting the line. Lars might be the last one in and he is. Whew. One knockout per round. z F6, Walligan, Scroll, Lars, Quick, and Tacky. Top three get into the prize pool. They're so close now. z <gasps> and Walligan both with mistakes. Who is gonna get at the worst? Walligan, does he have the speed to go up here? He does, but they're both gonna land awkwardly. They're both- Oh, they're not both upside down. Only z is upside down. He's gonna make the decision to turtle to the checkpoint and hope for a mistake in the ending. Walligan might see this three second gap and think he can save and perhaps he can. Tacky respawning the bug slide now a few times. Still elects to go for it and this is getting scary. <gasps> okay, going for the safe approach of the bug slide. Zemois is caught up to F6 now. Going for the bug slide. Does he get it? He doesn't. Where's F6? Not making it to the top platform. Zemois made it from upside down. To top six. And that is the North American players all out. Only Europe remains. Shows that even with a mistake in the start, you can still recover. That bug slide is scary. And it's so hard for the players to decide what to do. One player going very high there. Was that quick? It was. And this is a tough mistake. He will be able to... Get up to the top now, but everyone else... <gasps> no! It's the same situation, and oh my god, the pressure! This is a decision that can cost you $100. Do you go for the bug slide or not? If you're Zemois here... If you're Lars here, do you go for the bug slide or not? Quick is gonna go for it. Zemois making it. Quick going for the safe. Lars is still respawning and he goes too wide. Zemois though is also still respawning. Lars respawning again and that might be the nail in the coffin. Zemois is on the top platform now. 
and twice in a row he will make it with 20 seconds behind the first place time. Two spots away from the prize pool for everyone left. Still Quick, who won the qualifier. Still Techie, who's winning Khaki. Still Walgan, driving insane times. Still Scroll, who's been on an absolute tear. And still Zemus, who's been miraculously surviving. Now a very close round. One second between them all. Quick catching up and overtaking Zemus before the bug slide. What's the decision here? Walligan bug sliding. They're all bug sliding. They're all bug sliding. Walligan respawned. Techie and Scroll are making it. Zemo's made it. Quick on the left side. And Walligan. Oh, he's bug sliding, but Quick is so far up front. 48 and Walligan out. You basically had to go for this bug slide. You had to. That is an insane round on this map. Top four. The pressure's on. If you don't get last this round, you're guaranteed at least $100. In the next 40 seconds, it will be decided. Pressure is on. Zemo's going high. Does he control this? Does he control this? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay. Wants to respawn instead and keep more speed. I respect the decision and I think it's the right one. But the time loss is there. How much is this going to cost him? I think over five seconds here. Before the bug slide. Tacky though does not have good speed for this. If he goes for the bug slide with this low speed, this could get scary. I don't know if this makes it. I really don't know if this makes it. And he has to back out and he has to respawn. And this closes the gap. Zemo is now with way more speed. Could go for the bug slide. Does Techie make it the second time? <gasps> Onto this platform. That's not good at all. And Zemo is catching up. And Zemo is maybe overtaking Techie. Onto the line. Techie has less speed. And it will... Scroll respawn as well. Techie's still in. Uh oh. Uh oh. Scroll out. GG for scroll regardless. What a hero run. Hero run. So these three players are in the prize pool. Now, if you do not get knocked out here, you're guaranteed $300. Everyone makes it through the bobsleigh. <gasps> That's a sketchy landing, though. For all of them, really, but they all made it. A tenth between them. Zemo is releasing and also getting very low speed here before the bog slides. Does not have much to work with through the checkpoint. Techie and Quick going way faster. Do they get it? <gasps> Both backing out onto the lower platform. Techie respawning. Zemo is the one to get the best bug slide, and he is basically safe with that. Quick going to follow him into the final, and Techie gets third. It's Quick who won Quali versus Zemo, who's been surviving round after round. Good luck to both. $600 for first, $300 for second. Here it is. The final of the birthday cup. Quick with a better start, more speed before the bobsleigh. Harder to control though. Ooh. Good entry for both. Also good entry here. No mistakes are gonna decide the start here, but Quick has quite the lead. 0.7 through that attack point. Now in between the trees. Ooh, ooh. Zimu's hitting a palm tree. Can quick close it out here with a bug slide. Setting him to the top platform. He goes for it. It's not a lot of speed on the landing. Has to go for the low platform. Zimu's onto the high platform. Maybe. Maybe it's enough. It is not. He respawns. And quick takes the win. Both in the quali and a knockout. GG's. Very fun competition. Quick in first. Zimu second. Techie third. But to everyone else who competed here as well, this was an insane knockout. <laughs> and I think it kind of delivered in, in every way I wanted to with, uh, with how difficult this map is to drive consistently.